Good timing, Commander. We got a transmission coming in from the Citadel. Top priority clearance. Is it the Ambassador? It's not his signature. I think it's from the Council. I'll patch it through to the Comrade. Commander Shepard, we've received information that may be critical to your mission against Saren. You didn't seem that interested in helping me before. Why now? The Council agreed that Saren was dangerous, Commander. That was why we made you a Spectre. We only balked at unleashing the full force of the Citadel fleet against him. Nobody on the Council wants to see you fail, so we contacted you with this latest information. We've received an urgent message from one of our infiltration regiments in the Traverse. You mean spies? Spectres tend to attract attention, Commander. But they are only one arm of the Council. Special task groups are often a better option for monitoring developing situations. We currently have several infiltration units scattered throughout the border regions of Citadel space. This particular unit was gathering intel on Saren. What did they find? Unfortunately, the message we received was little more than static. The infiltration team must be in a situation where they can't set up proper interstellar communications. But the message was sent on a channel reserved for mission critical communications. Whatever they were trying to tell us, we know it was important. Considering your interest in Saren, we thought you might want to investigate this. Find out what happened to our team. The signal originated from the planet Vermeer. I'll look into it. The Council prefers not to become involved in the specifics of Spectre activities. We only want you to be aware of all your options, including Vermeer. Good luck, Commander Shepard. We will keep you advised if we learn anything else. message from Alliance Command coming in. I'll patch it through. Shepard, this is Admiral Hackett from Alliance Command. We've got a situation here and you're the only one that can handle it. What do you need, Admiral? There's an Alliance training ground where we test weapons and technology and live fire simulations. One of the VIs we use to simulate enemy tactics in the drills is no longer responding to our override commands. It's gone rogue. Are you telling me this computer is thinking on its own? We're not stupid, Shepard. This is a virtual intelligence, not a true AI. It's not self-aware, and it can't access any external systems. We didn't do anything illegal here. Virtual intelligence support is critical to our military success. VIs process thousands of status reports and react in nanoseconds. No human can do that. We need you to fight your way through the training ground of the VI Corps and manually disable it. Can't you disable it remotely? Our fail-safes aren't responding. The VI operates on a closed network. It can affect any external systems, but we don't have any direct access to its processes. We could bomb it from orbit, but the damage to the facility would be catastrophic. We'd prefer to have someone shut down the core. Someone like you. I know Spectre's answered the Council, but you're still human. You're still part of the Alliance military. And right now, we need you. The VI controls all the facilities, weapons, drones, and automated defenses. You're the only one that can pull this off, Shepard. Good luck.
Good timing, Commander. We got a transmission coming in from... It's not his signature. I think it's from the Council. I'll patch it through to the Comrade. Commander Shepard, we've received information. Nobody on the Council... We've received an urgent message. We currently have several in... Considering your... Look at Commander, urgent message from a We've got a situation here, and you're the only one. What do you need, Admiral? They're one of the VIs we use to simulate enemy. Rich, we need you to fight your way through the tra- I- the VI- I prefer gold to silver, you know, for my metal. I figured you'd recommend me for one since I, uh, hold your boots out of the fire. If we present you with a medal, you'll end up sitting on stage listening to politicians. Fun, fun. Jave, too. I spent the last seven weeks working on this baby. Commander, why don't you tell me why you're... Normandy performing. And the fleet balances too much ship for your average alliance. I like to know my crew. Mind if I... I can see where this is going. You did a background check on me. Top of my class and earned that. Oh. Put the norm maker. Equalizing interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. Logged. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. We saw your ship. Fidan wants to speak with you immediately. Who's Fidan? He's our leader. He needs your help to prepare for the Geth. They're making another push. Please, up the stairs past the freighter.
Make sure they're secure. Those geth are bloody dangerous. Glad to see some soldiers. Get ready. Die of thirst, the geth will surely kill us all. How is a woman supposed to think the gun is going off all night? Here, the Geth will kill us all. The Geth are mounting another attack. There, there, there. Yes. Just relax. My headaches are getting better. The Geth just keep coming. Commander, I'm glad they finally sent somebody to help us. You're a bit late, aren't you? Arcelia. Sorry, Commander. Everyone's on edge since... Watch out! We've got Geth in the tower! Protect the heart of the colony! I believe we are headed in the wrong direction. The tower is behind us. Get a vehicle safely out of the Normandy. The Geth base is our next objective. I'm grateful for what you've done, but your heroics don't impress me, Commander. Tell me more about yourself, Arcelia. I'm a rent-a-cop. 
I was hired to keep kids from writing graffiti on the walls at Exogeny. Then all this happened. I wasn't trained for this. I didn't ask for it. I just wanted to end. What can you tell me about the Geth? Do you have any idea what they might be after? I can't tell you anything about that. I suggest you go to Exogeny if you want answers to those questions. I get the feeling you don't like me. How would you feel if you were hung out to dry by every government organization that ever promised to keep you safe? They should have sent a small fleet. Instead, we get one ship. And you're only interested in the Geth. What can you tell me about Exogeny? Very little. I work there as a security officer. I know they were looking for artifacts and anything of value. That's what they do. They fund the colony. In return, we help them uncover buried treasure. It's definitely not as exciting as they make it sound. Tell me about Zoo's Hope. I can't tell you much about it. You should speak to Fai Dan if you want to know more. Goodbye. Commander. The tower's secure. Thanks to you, Commander. I'm just glad your colony is safe. I appreciate your concern and your efforts against the Geth. They may have been slowed, but they'll be back. They always come back. What do they want? If you want answers, go ask them yourselves. We don't know what they're after. They came, they attacked us, that's all we know. Their main base is at the Exogeny headquarters. A good place to start looking if you want answers. What's Exogeny? It's the company most of us work for before the attacks. They fund this colony. The Skyway leads directly to Exogeny headquarters. You can't miss it. Of course, there's an army of Geth between here and there. I didn't expect this would be easy. Then maybe I can get this colony operational again. What can you tell me about the defenses the Geth have set up? I don't have any details, but I'll wager it's a lot more fortified than the command post. They landed at least one Geth ship at Exogeny, and I've seen large walking tanks on the Skyway. Expect a hard fight. What do you need done to get this place back on its feet? We need those Geth destroyed. Arcelia's right. There are still Geth in the tunnels. We also have more mundane problems like food, water, and power. I'm not sure where we stand on those matters. You should talk to the people overseeing them. Do you have information about Geth in the lower tunnels? Nothing new. They're in the tunnel somewhere, likely guarding a transmitter to coordinate attacks. It's not a critical threat right now. But getting rid of that transmitter will help us defend against further attacks. Is there anything I can do to solve your water shortage? Maka Doyle has been assigned to that particular issue. If you have any insight to offer, please speak with her. What's wrong with the colony's power supply? May O'Connell is working on our power problems. She'd know more about it than I do. You mentioned something about a food shortage. Davin Reynolds is tasked with securing food for the immediate future. If you can assist, please speak with him. Let's talk about Zeus, Hope, and Pharos in general. Of course, Commander. What else can you tell me about Exogeny? Exogeny funded this colony. Without them, we wouldn't be stuck here. They specialize in colonization. In return for bankrolling the colony, we work for them. Their main goal is the retrieval of valuable artifacts or resources. Except there isn't anything here. Or if there is, we didn't find it. I wonder if that's what the Geth are looking for. Perhaps. As she said, we never found anything of value. Of course, the Geth could know something we don't. I'll talk to you when I learn more. Good luck, Commander. You'll have to forgive my wife. Kalantha's not in her right mind. She just needs to relax and accept what's happened. What do you do for the colony? I'm a medic. Or I am since the doctor died. I've tried my best since she was killed. Do you know anything about this planet? Just what I was told by Colonial Affairs. It's a little different from what they claimed. It's not all bad, though. When the Geth are gone, we'll have a chance to create something even more spectacular than before. What happened to your wife? The constant attacks have strained us all. She'll adapt. We all have. Is there anything I can do for her? No, she just needs time. Time to absorb everything. We'll be fine. 
What happened to your wife? The constant attacks have strained us all. She'll adapt. Tell me about the colony. I can't tell you much about that. You'd best ask Fidan if you really must know. Why can't you tell me? I just want to know about the colony. Fidan is our leader. Who better to answer questions about the colony? I have to go. Please. Hello, Offworlder. I'm glad that we aren't totally forgotten by the rest of the galaxy. Dear, please try to rest. You're, you're not ready to speak. But they should know... Uh... I mean, they are very important. Yes. That's better. Is there anything I can do for you? I'm fine. I just need to try to think clearly. It's just a lingering pain from... from the last attack. I'll be fine. I see no major injury, but something must be causing her pain. Please, just let her rest. She just needs rest. It hurts so much when I think about what we've lost. You're the one who repelled that last wave. They'll be back. And if the Geth don't kill us, we'll die of hunger soon enough. Are you doing anything to remedy the situation? I need to boost rations with Varen meat, but it's too dangerous. The Alpha Varen, he's huge and he's mad. Rabid, maybe. Totally uncontrollable. I can't do anything until he's dead. I have a ship. I could bring in supplies from off-world. I'd rather you concentrated on the Geth. Food won't help us if they breach our defenses. Tell me about Zeus Hope. The colony is growing. Or it was. But you should speak with Fidan. He is our leader. Why should I speak to Fidan? Why can't you tell me? I don't want to talk about that right now. Speak with Fidan. Tell me about yourself. What's to tell? I came here with my wife Greta, looking for adventure. A new life together. This isn't exactly what we signed up for. Really starting to enjoy.